Hey guys and welcome to the Corona Shadow Catcher tutorial. Uh, this is not a new tutorial, it's a tutorial that has been already done but uh, since it has been uh, made a lot of things in Corona changed so uh, this is going to be updated version. It's going to be divided in five parts, uh, first of which is this one, which is just basically overview of what we will be looking at. Uh, even if you saw uh, the previous one, uh, it's still good if you watch this one as well, because uh, there might be some new things you can learn uh, about features that have been added ever since the last one was made. Uh, so the first part will be uh, about typical use case scenario where you have both HDR map and a backplate and uh, in that part I will be also showing how to ex exclude the backplate from the color mapping so it remains unaffected by the color transformations. Uh, second part will, will be just uh, using HDR map only you know, without the backplate so that's another use case that we will cover. Uh, the third part will be uh, about setting up shadow catcher for compositing, basically just uh, having separate layer of our CG objects uh, and then compositing it on top of the of the backplate. And the last part uh, will be about using illuminator lights. So that's it and I will see you in the next lesson where we will be covering usage with HDR and a backplate.